What is up, fucks? It's I, Jet, and I'm here on my cell phone <laughs> to talk to you. Um, yeah, I have to use my cell phone today, so that's always fun. I'm sorry if you hear my computer, uh, for some reason, it's not listening to me, it's raging against me. It's not my friend today. I'm trying to make it do what I say and it's not doing what I say. I might light it on fire, I'm not quite sure. <clears throat> yeah, I'll probably light it on fire. <clears throat> so, I got to see Repsion's video was fantastic. Really lift my spirits. Made me happy. Really did. Chantal got the credit she wanted. Yay. And he raised aware awareness of a hmm, tiny insignificant wiener diseased man's nodder's business that he's got going. And man, it just brightened my day really did congratulations this has not been i'm not having a, a great time so that really made me happy it just it just turned a frown upside down it really did so thank you for that repsion you're amazing yeah I'm, lately has not been a, a stupendous time it's just really not. The past week and a half has been nothing but a shitstorm here. I want to punch myself in the face just about every day. Or to be kicked in the face with a golf shoe. These are either one, really. I'm taking volunteers of anyone who feels like kicking me in the face with a, a golf shoe. Seriously. <sighs> Right now, we're trying to take care of my daughter's uh, senior pictures. And because she had summer school, she wasn't uh, made a senior till the actual beginning of the school year. And for some odd reason, the senior pictures are done over the summer before the school year starts, which is whatever that's fine it's done at the beginning of the school year before school starts you get this little packet sent in the mail and it gives you you know an invitation and all that to sign up for school pictures and it, you go to the school and take your pictures well because she was in summer school she didn't get her packet and she didn't go to get her pictures well they have makeup picture day again they she didn't get her code she couldn't sign up for the retakes and she missed it so we're trying to figure that shit out, which, yeah, it's a pain in the fucking ass. And it's really just taking a piss on my parade. I'll figure it out, though. I, I'll figure it out. But it's still, it's a pain in the ass. We'll probably have to go to the company that does the school pictures. And they their office is like an hour away from where we live, but we'll... We'll have to go there and probably take the senior pictures there. And we kind of have to or her face is, her picture is not going to be in the yearbook. They don't do actual, she can't go and take pictures like the other kids. Like, you don't get to just take school pictures as normal. She'll have no picture in the yearbook otherwise. <laughs> so we have no choice. So that's fun. Yeah, so that, that's that been a, like a wonderful a cherry on the top of my week. Plus, I've, my daughter has already been diagnosed with bipolar disorder. See? I'm the gift that keeps on giving. <clears throat> 
So that's one thing. I've given one of my kids an issue, <clears throat> which, you know, it's no big deal, really. I just take her to my therapist, and she has a counselor there of her own. So, I mean, she's squared away now. We're good with that. But now, I'm pretty sure, this is my son's been having stomach issues lately, that I have now given my son my IBS, which is great. Like, why couldn't I have given him something cool? You know, like a superpower. Like, I've given him the power to fly or to x-ray vision or some shit. Something cool. No. I had to give him something extremely painful that restricts your diet. <sighs> you know? I am just the gift that keeps on giving. Not to mention that I also gave him ADHD. Can I quit now? Is it time to quit? Can I quit? No. I'm just living the dream right now. Also, we've started this new thing for our business. Um, we're running double fields now. Our first field was the bigger one where everyone was able to play seven and up. I run it just in case you don't know. You subscribed and you, you've never heard what business I run. Me and my husband run a Nerf business. We, we basically throw large scale Nerf battles in a field at our um, fairgrounds. We have cover for them to hide behind, stuff like that. And we have a bunch of different games that we've come up with, with different objectives and things like that. And, uh, now we've decided to start another field for the older kids 13 and up it's a higher fps weapons or well, you know nerf blasters most of them are 3d printed now and it's instead of you know a higher fps and it's more painful of course and a whole different type of objectives and things of that nature for this for the other field so now we have to use two cameras which is kind of fun because my kids like to they like also like photography so those the that other field my kids now get to practice photography on the other field but it's still a lot of work so now we have we're running two cameras on because we have two fields and my kids take the pictures but they can't um they don't know photo editing and thing, things like that so i'm now editing two cameras worth of pictures it is so freaking nerve-wracking but it's like this is our life now <laughs> so it's been like really stressful <sighs> So now I have to do more pictures into the Instagram instead of just like one set for each event we have because we run it once a month. 
I have to put more pictures for each event because we were running two fields. Can I get off this ride? I don't want to. I'm I'm done. I don't want to play anymore. Can I can I get off? I just want to go home. I'm too tired. No. Okay. Roger that. <laughs> I tell you what, though. Loki? He's brain damaged. Pretty sure. He tried to go outside today through the door when I was holding open the other one. And he ran into the door frame. I'm not sure, but... He, he might be an idiot. No, I'm pretty sure he's an idiot. Yeah. He's cute though. He is pretty cute. Mm. I have to go pick up the kids again tomorrow. So maybe you guys, we can do the judgmental thing and make fun of people's clothes again. It was really fun the last time. Made me feel better. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. My daughter heard that video. She thinks there's something wrong with me now. All I'm saying is, how did she not know there was something wrong with me before? Well, I, ha I have like a horrible hatred of ducks. I literally yell at ducks as we go past the pond down the street. I, I like roll down my window and yell profanity at ducks. She should know there's something wrong with me, honestly. She's almost 18 years old. She's lived in the same house with me. She should know by now that there is absolutely something wrong with me. Plus when I get road rage, like I yell profanity inside the car and then I get so worked up, they just grab my face and make like a puking noise because I just I just get so angry that I make no, that I can make no sense, nor words or sentences. I just grab my face and try to yank it off. I hate people in traffic that don't know how to drive. It makes me homicidal. <laughs> um. Well, I just want to let you guys know that I saw the Repsy on video. It was amazeballs. Well, that's it. Oh, PSI, please. Homecoming's coming up. Can you guys do me a favor? If your kids want to wear something that's different from their actual gender, like if your kid transitions from a female to a male, but you're in denial, but they want to wear a suit, please fucking let them wear a suit. What does it matter, honestly? What does it matter? It's not going to hurt anybody. Who gives a shit? Seriously. Let them wear a fucking suit. What are the consequences for your kid not wearing a suit? 
There is none. Seriously. It makes your kid happy. And stop dead naming them. It's absolute disrespect at the highest level. You're just being a douche one. You're just being a douche one, for real. And each time you do it, you're making your kid want to leave as fast as possible when they grow up. Let your kid wear what they want to homecoming. Don't be an asset. Love Jack. <laughs> I will talk to you guys later. Like, share, subscribe. Seriously. Deuces.